What's up guys, it's Ben Quaddy here and welcome to the top 5 edits from subscribers for 1.7k. Thank you very much for that, uh, I actually can't imagine how many people follow me now. And um, I'll explain the rules to this or how this top 5 edits works at the end of the video in case you're new so stay around for that. But anyway, the 5th place of this time goes to an editor called Snowy and um, He's got a little mini edit right here, and uh, what I really liked about this edit is um, the cinematics were really nice. Also, the blur transitions at some points are very good, and also like the CC a lot and the song he picked. But um, in my opinion, this edit had a lot of potential. There's uh, quite a lot of things you could have improved on. Um, for example, well, the wiggle is a bit too over the top, uh, like the rotation is so heavy, and there's only shake and wiggle, there's no real pan crop, which um, is really missing, and sometimes the sync is a bit off, but um, other than that, really nice edit, man, and good job. And for the number 4 of this time, we've got Nickman right here, and I'm pretty sure I've had him in the first top 5 edits already when I hit 1.4k. Yeah, um, but anyway, I really like this edit because it was um, a bit different than the usual you see. It's um, some kind of a dark style edit, I guess, because of this um, dark color correction. And I also like the orange glow in the middle. Uh, it looked very nice. Um, the sync is very good as well, and something you could work on is flowing your cinematics better, like throwing some pan crop and some velocity or a twixter, whatever you sync with, and just make it suit the music better, because some of these play so slow, um, it doesn't look as good. But other than that, really nice edit, and congrats on the number 4 spot. And on to the third spot, we've got Temp right here, um, with an edit on it, introducing for some console player, and um, he made the edit work with the music so well, and that's why I really enjoyed it. Um, actually, there's a lot of things I could compliment in here. Um, yeah, the syncing was very nice, I also liked the flickering a lot that he used, and also the cinematics look amazing at some points. Um, yeah, he, f he flowed everything very well, and there's not really much I can say for um, improvements. The only thing I'm not the biggest fan of is um, the way he made his pan crop look is when it already zooms in like a second before the shot and I prefer it when it starts zooming in right when the shot goes off but um, I guess that's personal preference. I know a lot of people wouldn't mind this. Um, I, it's not a big thing but um, that's maybe something I would change. But anyway, amazing edit man and congress in the third place. And actually I gotta say this time it was really hard to pick who to put first and who to put second. Um, but I went with this. Um, the second spot goes to an editor called Raynan, and actu I actually know two editors now who are called Raynan, and they got similar styles as well with these short edits, which is pretty weird, but um, anyway, uh, this guy actually submitted two edits, I'm showing a bit of both right here, and I gotta say they're perfectly amazing, there's nothing I'd like change about them, they've got really unique music, nothing overused, like trap stuff or anything, and uh, he's got a unique way to it too, that uh, he does his edits with those um, little texts and um, images on the screen. So yeah, if you want to see these full edits, check them out in the description, and great job Brain and uh, congrats on the number 2 spot. And the first place this time goes to LSK, and he's been in the series uh, the third time now, I'm pretty sure, and um, some people might say that the second place was better than this, and um, I can agree that it had better flow and everything, and maybe better effects, but the thing about LSK is um, he really shows dedication, he's improved a lot since his last edits in my opinion, and he put so much work into this you can tell like um, he got into a lot of 3D stuff, which I'm a really big fan of, and um, did a lot of animating. Uh, overall a very good edit, only thing what I would say is uh, sometimes you can tell the lens flares aren't tracked properly, but um, other than that, um, it's an amazing edit, I really enjoyed it, and um, good job with the animations actually. Um, I know that it takes quite a while to do these and to get into it all, so um, you show dedication and you really deserve the first spot because you've been in this two times now and you've always been third. So, um, congrats man and um, 
thank you everyone for watching. Thank you for submitting your edits. And if you're wondering how this top five plays, uh, top five edits works, you can submit any of your edits. Just send me your favorite one. Um, it doesn't. You don't have to make a separate one for these top five edits. It just be any of your edits, and I will then pick who are the top five and give feedback as I just did for these guys. And you would see your edit on my channel possibly when I hit 1.8k. So I um, hope you understood that. If you have any uh, like questions you can ask in the comments and you can find my details about Skype, Twitter and everything, how to message me in the description. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'm going to see you in the next commentary with that sex German accent. Bye.